uh, today we're going to cook an embutido without using a uh, steamer. So we're just going to bake it. So our ingredients are 3 tablespoons of soy sauce. One teaspoon of Mrs. Dash. One half cup of raisins. Two teaspoon of oregano. And one teaspoon of garlic powder. One half cup of chopped onions. One half cup of uh, sweet pickles, or three uh, three eggs, three eggs sliced quarterly. Add one eight teaspoon of salt. Whisk one egg and add to the ground pork. One pound of ground pork all we have to do is uh, just add the three tablespoons of soy sauce into the uh, ground pork that looks good yeah that's look good so you can add spices one teaspoon of mrs dash Raisins. Mm. Wow, look good. I love raisins. Two teaspoons of oregano and one teaspoon of garlic powder. Mm. Half cup chopped onions. And half cup of sweet pickles. Mm, it smells good. Yeah. Okay, it smells wow. good. So you mix them all. Okay, you mix them all uh, nicely. It smells See? really good. Yeah, it oh, smells. Oh, good. Makes me hungry. Oh, the pickles. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> no, I. Oh yeah, I like the. I pickles. never heard that uh, you put pickles with it too. Oh, yeah. that's my I like recipe. The pickles and the oh. raisins. That's the way we. Yeah, even the raisins. Raisin. Yeah, oh, really. I love raisins. And I love the pickles. Because wow. one time my cousin, you know, because he's like a chef back home too, and then he just have meat and you know the egg, and that's about it. Mm -hmm. If I recall, yeah. We add one uh, egg, one scrambled egg. Just uh, scramble it and add it, and and then mix it again. Yeah, mix it. To make it like what? Smooth or it's yeah, stick it, together? Yeah. Okay. It's also add taste. It will add oh. taste mm -hmm. to the... Well, this is going to be my mm -hmm. second time to eat that. Okay, yeah. it becomes smooth too. Mmm, smells so mm. good. <laughs> Can I okay. eat it now? <laughs> Just kidding. Now we need the wrap. And then wrap. Okay, we need to wrap it. Wrap it in the... Foil. Okay, that's for that one, and that's for here for us. So how many rolls we can make? Uh, for one pound, I think we can make three or uh, oh, wow. Okay, so all you have to do is just like this. Scoop, it. scoop, scoop a little bit. You do like this, uh, and give me the eggs, mana. You just do like this. Uh, wow. Just like that. And so you know, we wash our hands already. Yeah, oh, yeah we need to wash our hands. Yeah, just make sure. <laughs> of course, you need to wash your hands. Yeah. Okay, and then you add the eggs. Okay, you can make it there for okay. yourself. I'm gonna make some. And help, also. you can help with her. I never done this before. Yeah, you put so this like this. I would like to uh -huh. make one. And you put add this here. Wow, and then how are you gonna do that then? You next. Then you add. Oh, cover it up. Cover it up. Roll All it. Right. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's pretty neat and yummy. <laughs> I 
I'm gonna try this out. Yes. Let's look at my salted here for us. Yeah. It seems really yeah. fast and you know. Yeah, yeah this okay. is good for for um uh, for the for oh. the holidays. You know you want a special yeah. all you have to do is just make like this. So did they make it right? Yeah, yeah you did okay. no no like this. Like you long straight, like, yeah. Oh okay. And I think we have to move a little bit because it's kinda of, kind of um and then you just roll like this, roll it. Wow, that's really fast. Roll, yeah. yeah. Just roll like that. This is kind of dish that, you know, it's for me to cook because I'm kind of lazy. Yeah, roll like this at the end and roll like that at the end. Oh, no, I know how really make in potato. Oh, yeah. yeah, they call it in potato. I think we have enough, so I have that much enough for another batch or Yeah, I think we have we have we just make a small one, just cover that up. Yeah. And then we cook it to 350 degrees for how many minutes? For one hour and a half. For one pound of uh, ground pork, but if you're cooking two pound of ground pork then you're gonna cook like two, um, two and a half hour. Does that make a difference? Even though yes. if we cook it like uh, in that size, we still have to make it to like two hours. Sometimes. If if you cook more, uh, but if okay. you cook only like one pound like we have right now, right. Uh, we just cook it for one hour and a half. Okay. Because that's uh that's good enough. Yeah, because we have to cook the pork thoroughly because uh -huh. we can yeah. get warm from it if it's not cooked. Yeah, that's yeah. right. So all yeah. you have to do is just, um, yeah. Roll it like this. Yeah. You move a little bit here. Move, uh, move near enough oh, so that you okay. can roll it. There you go. Okay. Yeah, we cover it. Okay. I'm going to add more here. So I want to finish all the eggs. Yeah, here. don't okay. waste anything. Yeah. And then here we can make uh, for the one pound of pork, we can make it three, three, uh, three rolls. Wow, it's a it's a good sign. I'm kind of slow pork. because I never does this before. It's my first time. It uh, sounds and it looks like really you know easy fast and, easy, yeah. and it's yeah. very tasty. I have. We I always cook this before. Now I'm gonna gain some weight now, because I'm gonna keep cooking this because it's fast. That's it's good for holiday. It's easier. See? It's good for the holiday. Yeah, for Christmas. I'm gonna mm -hmm. try this for Christmas. Let and then you roll it. I would you like to try it. this too. For New Year, for New Year is uh, best for New Year too. Okay, now we're ready to, to bake it. So all you have to do is just uh, put any baking um, tray and you need to cook it for uh, one hour and a half. Now this is ready to bake. Then we're gonna set our uh, oven to 350 degrees. Now we're ready to bake it. You have to be careful not to burn yourself. There you go, you close it. So now it's already in the oven and now we're waiting for like one hour and a half and, and it's done. Now I cut it like this. Now you can see how how uh, looks good. See I can serve it, I can put that here. You can like just do like this or just remove it with the foil. And you just remove it like that with the foil. Now I'm finished cutting, so we are ready to eat. So now we're eating the potato. We're eating it with rice. It, it is really good. Thank you for watching.